All new at six, we are hearing from Bill's Mafia. They are frustrated over details leaking out of the personal seat license process. Yeah, these PSLs are what fans will need to purchase for the team's new stadium just in order to then earn the right to purchase season tickets. But some people, they worry that the cost may price out longtime Buffalo Bills fans. PSL conversations are taking place all over social media right now with images like these floating around Facebook and Instagram. Now, this appears to show the cost of a field club level PSL at $30,000. Wow, the Bills keeping much of that PSL process behind closed doors though at their Stadium Experience Center in Williamsville. But these early reports have some fans concerned about affordability. That's why 7 News reporter Maki Becker taking the time to listen to what Bill's Mafia is saying about all of this. Buffalo are blue collar fans, like hardworking middle class people that cannot afford this. And everyone feels like they are pricing out the Bill's Mafia and they want to fill those seats with corporations. <laughs> Buffalo Bills fans like Meredith Paddock tell me there's no place she and her kids would rather be than inside the new Bills stadium cheering on their home team. But now fans are learning that season tickets at the new stadium will come with a steep price. The Bills are starting to roll out prices for PSLs, personal seat licenses, and many people I talk to are stunned. I have three kids I have to put through college. <laughs> And two of my boys are diehard fans, and they're not happy that mom's going to walk away and say no. I reached out to the Bills Monday, and they haven't confirmed any of the numbers flying around social media. But if PSL prices at other new stadiums are any indication, fans could be looking at shelling out tens of thousands of dollars. The new Atlanta Falcon Stadium, which opened in 2017, charges from $11,000 up to $47,000 for PSLs to club level seats. For general seating, $500. It's a new concept in Buffalo. We haven't had it in the past, and historically we've had one of the lowest ticket prices in the league because we've had an old stadium. Longtime season ticket holder David Shores flies out from Colorado several times a year for games. He doesn't know yet what he'll be asked to pay. But why keep all the PSL uh, stadium pricing secret? Why let out just the club pricing, which is astronomical? Why not let every season ticket holder see what they have in mind for their seats? The bill's saying in a statement that it'll take quite some time for each season ticket holder to get a chance to pick their seats and find out what they'll pay. I just wish the organization would listen to us and lower the cost or offer different payment options or do something to get that stadium filled with the fans that deserve to be there and should be there. Maki Becker, 7 News, Buffalo.